Hello guys, today I'll be showing you the Foof bug, uh, which was a bug that was present in the Intel Pentium, Pentium MMX, and Overdrive. And uh, this this bug essentially crashed the system. And um, I, I'm I'm no I'm no expert in how it works, but uh, I I can show it to you. I already created a disk with um, a com file which I have written um, with the foof bug. So I'm going to turn this computer on. I'm going to hold down the F8 button so I can get to the startup menu. I'm going to select command prompt only. So now if I insert my disk here, you really can't see the screen well. Anyway, let's do a directory listing. I might put this a little bit closer. There you go. Now you can see this. And uh, I am just going to run foof.com. And now the system has crashed. I can't turn on caps lock or number lock or anything. I can take this out. Put it back in. Nothing. My only option is to turn the computer off by force. Right, now we'll just open my computer. Right, now I'm gonna put the disk in again. And there is our foof file. So now if we run it, the computer has looked up. And that's all it does. Uh, I'm gonna show you now how to create your own executable so you can run this bug if you have a computer like, did it, like this. I'm gonna press F8. No! There we go, okay. Command prompt only. And uh, once you're in DOS, um, you wanna run copy, con, and then any any <laughs> any file name you want, as long as it ends in .com, like, you know, foof.com. What you want to do is you want to type alt240, now you want to press F6, enter, and once you have written your file, just type foof, and there you go. You can see my, my light ain't lighting, and that's it. Thanks for watching guys, um, hope you liked the video.